Taurus. Hello, what's up, what's up, what's up? It's your girl here, Miss Hawaii, coming at y'all. Let me make sure the microphone, hold on. Make sure y'all can hear me loud and clear. Coming at y'all to give y'all y'all general love reading. I hope all is well with my beautiful Taurians. Couple things before I get into your reading. First of all, if it's your first time here, welcome. This is Miss Hawaii Tarot. I'm so happy that you are here today with me. Thank you and welcome, welcome, welcome. Shout out to all the new people that is their first time here. And shout out to all my OGs, triple OGs that have been rocking with me since the beginning. I love y'all. Thank you. All right. If you are a member, thank you so much for being a member. If you would like to become a member, click that join button in the description box. I have the link. And there's also a join button right under this video. You get access to different readings throughout the week. You also become a member of the Secret Society. And it's a great way to support this channel. So click that join button to become a member. Personal readings, you can email me, MissHawaiiReadings at gmail.com. That is MissHawaiiReadings at gmail.com. I do ask for one to two weeks to get you the reading. If you want it expedited, you can pay an expedited fee, and I'll get you the reading within 24 hours. All right, so that's MissHawaiiReadings at gmail.com. I look forward to hearing from you. Following this reading is going to be the extended, where I'm going to pull your person's cards over on Vimeo, see how they feel about you, see what actions are going to be taking moving forward towards you, and we'll also get advice for you from the universe. Thank you to all my Taurians who purchased the extended last week. I appreciate all I appreciate all of your love and support. You guys are amazing. All right, you guys are what makes this channel grow. So thank you, thank you, thank you. To donate to this channel, I have information in the description box below. Thank you to everybody that's donated. All your donations go towards tarot decks. Tarot books, tarot crystals, um, incense, sage, candles, any tools to help me help you. So I thank you guys so much for all of your donations. To donate, I have the information in the description box. All right. Don't forget to subscribe to my other channel, Miss Hawaii Scorpios. Um, if you have Scorpio in your chart or you're dealing with your Scorpio or you just are, you know, uh, intrigued by Scorpios, interested in knowing more about Scorpios, or you just want to support your girl. Don't forget to subscribe to that channel. I'm trying to build that channel for you guys. All right. And don't forget to follow me on Instagram, Miss Hawaii Tarot. Trying to build that, um, that page as well. So that way you guys have another platform to contact me on and to connect with me on. So make sure you go ahead and find, follow Miss Hawaii Tarot. I'm talking too fast on Instagram. All right. Other than that, uh, what do I have to say? If the video resonates, don't forget to leave me a comment if you feel comfortable. Let me know how the video resonates. Um, if not, at least just like the video, subscribe, show your girl some love, and don't forget to tell a friend. All right? So, let's get into your reading, Taurus. How has Taurus been feeling in love, Spirit? Thank you, Spirit, for a clear and guided reading today for all my beautiful and sexy Taurians. Please show me how my Taurians feeling in love. Oh boy, the Prince of Page of Wands in reverse tried to pop out. Let's keep going. Some of you guys may be dealing with a fire sign. It could be an Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Show me my Taurians. Show me my Taurians. Oh. Thank you, Spirit. Thank you, Spirit. What we got? Who that? Page of Swords. Oh, shit. Some of y'all dealing with an Aquarius, Libra, Gemini here. Okay. Could be somebody definitely keeping an eye on you because that Page of Swords is very... Oh, wait. That's the Knight of Swords. Oh, okay. Excuse me. Um, Some of y'all dealing with an Earth... Uh, oh, Heavy Air. King of Swords here now. That's not you. Then we got the Tower. Could be a Scorpio you're dealing with here. What else we got from my Taurians? Death. Ooh. Double Scorpio energy. Yo, shit crazy. Let's see what we got. The Queen of Swords, you coming up as a match with somebody. Oh, shit now. Taurus, what's going on with your shit? How is Taurus feeling in love?
the justice in reverse could be dealing with a libra somebody here ain't do right by you some of y'all going through a divorce i'm seeing an ending here i'm seeing a definitely an ending here but you and this person are coming up as a match the devil Whew. one more card that's capricorn energy right there wow boy what the fuck and then we got the page of pentacles and reverse oh, that's the knight i keep getting it confused bottom of the deck what we got there you go taurus the queen of pentacles male or female what the fuck going on here though the empress behind it somebody might be pregnant so what i'm seeing so far is your major iconic cards you got four here which is huge um you got the tower you got the death card you got the justice in reverse and the devil there's something toxic here around this connection here um i'm seeing an ending with the death card death also means new beginnings so some of you this may be something new you and your person are coming up as a match so i'm not sure what's going on here um the king and queen of swords then we got some changes happening pretty quickly so let's see. Show me the Knight of Swords here. The Magician. Okay. So some of you guys have been manifesting some changes and they're coming. Okay. I'm seeing somebody here that's working really hard. A Taurus here that's focused on work. Making it into the bag. Yep. Didn't I just say Eight of Pentacles in reverse? You might be working right now to take care of yourself. The Six of Pentacles is here on the bottom. So... Maybe you're working on yourself, working on self-improvement. Um, hmm, let's see. Show me the Knight of Pentacles in reverse. The King of Swords in reverse. Who is this with the world? Y'all close out a cycle here with somebody. Somebody here was cold towards you king of swords in reverse i'm you getting heavy air energy here aquarius libra gemini there's somebody here that's not putting in work no more in this connection and i'm seeing a taurus here that's manifesting new you're the magician some of y'all been praying you've been talking to your spirit guides something here is going on with you and this person i feel like there may be no communication right now this person may be being really stern with you let's see show me the king of swords The Knight of Cups in reverse. Oh, boy. The Lovers. Ho, oh, ho. Gemini energy. Ho, oh, oh. ho. Heavy air energy for you, Taurus. Four of Swords in reverse. Bottom of the deck. Five of Wands. Seeing some drama going down here with this person. Conflict. There's disappointment here. Lovers is here. Somebody is hurt over you. Over the way things turned out. The lovers is here. That can indicate a soulmate connection, a twin flame bond here. Show me the four of swords in reverse. The ace of swords with the eight of cups. Somebody here walked away because something wasn't fulfilling here to them and they had to walk away. Maybe you got clarity here from the universe. But somebody here is having a soulmate connection with you, a bond here with you. Show me the Knight of Cups in reverse. I'm seeing disappointment in love. Three of Cups. Could have been a third party situation here. Somebody here is moving on. It's time to move on. Wow. Let's see. Show me the tower, please. Seven of Pentacles. Still trying to decide here if it's worth it. There was a breakup, separation here. Something could have happened unexpectedly, out of nowhere. The Seven of Cups. Okay. Trying to make decisions here. You got two sevens here. Sevens are about growth, faith, the hermit, Virgo energy. So I'm looking at a Taurus here who is trying to heal here from a very painful ending. Something here could have came out. Something unexpected that just was like a shock to the system. And I feel like you're still trying to see here if it's worth to invest in it. Now, it might be if it might have been somebody here that you invested in, whether it's financially, emotionally. And I feel like now you're really trying to connect to your spirit guides here to figure out what to do. 
where do I go? What do I do? Um, the Hermit is a very spiritual card. Um, it's about soul searching here. Maybe I'm looking at a Taurus here that's um, in solitude mode. Just kind of staying to yourself right now. Trying to figure out what to do after this crazy moment. The High Priestess in reverse. Okay, you're trying to connect to your intuition here. Maybe it's been difficult trying to. The Empress is here. Okay, you know your self-worth. I like that, Taurus, with the Hierophant in reverse. Your Major Arcana card in reverse. So I'm seeing here, for some of you guys, this was a uh, ending of a marriage, a very spiritual connection, a strong connection you have with somebody, relationship. I'm seeing an ending here. I feel like you chose yourself. For this death card, you got three major arcana cards. So this was something very serious for you. This new beginning, this ending, could have been some secrets here with the high priestess in reverse, things that were hidden from you. Show me the high priestess in reverse, the knight of swords in reverse. Maybe that's you leaving. With the nine of cups because you, you're deciding to choose your happiness show me the empress some of y'all found out somebody else here was pregnant show me the empress that's not for everybody obviously show me the empress the world see more major arcana with the king of cups the sad thing is that you do love this person some of y'all are dealing with a scorpio i'm seeing heavy scorpio energy or a water sign uh cancer pisces you had to choose yourself so the best thing to do to do was to close out this cycle and some of y'all this was a marriage okay this person could have lied to you could have been abusive for some of you show me the hierophant please spirit thank you so much in reverse the four of cups okay with the ace of cups new love I'm seeing a Taurus here that's ready for new. Um, you were discontent in this connection, in this marriage, whatever was going on here. Some of you, there was a third party situation. You know, it was a lot of secrets here and it was time for you to choose your happiness. That's what I'm getting. Let's see the Queen of Swords. Some of you, I'm sensing strongly here, this was a marriage and now you're divorced or you're getting a divorce. Not for all of you, of course. Show me the Queen of Swords. Mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. two sixes here sixes are about growth the ace of wands wow okay with the six of pentacles here some of y'all about to get paid by this person or i'm seeing somebody giving you gifts money um buying you things or trying to extend themselves to you but i feel like you're moving on six of swords with the ace of wands it's time for a new beginning it's time to be happy uh, this as much as this hurts this relationship is not it's not succeeding it's not successful this connection it's time for me to choose me and move on and this was a very serious thing for you to do Taurus all right let's see the justice in reverse The Ace of Cups. The Death card again. Two different tarot decks and the Knight of Swords. I'm seeing a fucking Taurus here that really left. It could have definitely been a third party situation here. Um, but it's like you guys are trying to have new beginnings. You want new love. I'm saying new love. You were done wrong. Somebody didn't do right by you. Absolutely didn't. Somebody could have left you. Show me the Ace of Cups. Six of Pentacles. Show me the Ace of Cups. Yeah, you want to you want to equal give and take in this new love. The Moon. Show me the Ace of Cups. And the Tower. Yeah, it's time for change with the Strength card. Could be dealing with a Leo. It's time for change and you want to equal give and take. I don't feel like you were getting this from this person. Okay, um, there may have been some lies, some confusion here, deception here with this person, with the moon card and the tower. Something here, you know, it could have been a shake to the, you know, a shock to the system for you. Show me the death card, please, spirit. The Hierophant in reverse. I'm telling you, some of y'all, there was definitely a spiritual connection here or marriage. Yeah, you cut somebody out. You're coming up as the queen of swords again, male or female. You made the decision here. You didn't want any more toxicity with the devil card. Could be a Capricorn you're dealing with here. 
I'll make sure you can see all the cards. Um, and you made the decision here that you don't want to be in any more toxicity. Some of y'all were the other woman or other man. Maybe you were dealing with somebody that was married. Okay, with that higher family verse, not all of you. But that's your major arcana card again. Okay, um, you don't want any more toxicity here. It could have been an unhealthy attachment for some of you. The Queen of Swords is very smart. Okay, she's very perceptive. You use your brain, use your mind, you put your heart aside. The Queen of Swords has also been through a lot. She's been scorned. She's had her heart broken millions of times. Okay, it was time. Show me the Knight of Swords in reverse. The Page of Pentacles. See, you're shifting your energy here. Some of you guys may be interested in somebody else. Yeah, you gave up here on this situation. And it's time to shift your energy. Some of you, somebody here is focused on school, a specific Taurus I'm seeing. You just put your, your, you know, you're trying to focus on, you know, improving your life. You're not going to dwell on this no more. You got a breakthrough here from the universe. The Ace of Swords is about clarity, a breakthrough. Okay. It's time to heal. It's time to heal. And that's exactly what you're doing. Show me the devil. Show me the devil. Some of you guys are dealing with a Capricorn. Show me the devil, please, Spirit. Thank you. The Four of Cups. Very discontent. Very unhappy in this relationship. There's the Ace of Swords again. Clarity here. This is unhealthy. You know what I mean? What kind of atta what kind of attachment is this I have to this person? What kind of attachment is it that this person has towards me? It's time for a new beginning. Aries energy. It's time to take a leap of faith into the unknown. Because this just isn't working for me. I'm realizing it. I'm not happy. You know what I mean? Um, I don't like where I don't like where we are. I don't like what this feels like. I don't like how I'm being treated. The universe is telling me that I don't like, you know what I mean? I, I don't like the way I'm being treated. Even though I've invested in this person, even though I've given this person lots of time, energy. I even care about them a lot, love them possibly a good deal, you know, a great deal. I'm not happy. This is toxic. Okay. Show me the Knight of Pentacles in reverse. Two of Pentacles. Some of y'all got more than one person here. The Nine of Wands. And the eight of cups yep yeah. yeah with the justice again in reverse twice from two different tarot decks under that is a five of wands conflict drama mm, Taurus you've been through a lot with this person too I think you really made the decision here to look at everything and say wow I'm the wounded warrior this person has put me through a lot I'm really trying to juggle here to see what do I do boom it's time to walk away. It's time to shift my energy. Not invest in this anymore. It's time to think about me. It's time to think about me. You are the empress and you are the queen of pentacles. Your money looks great, by the way. All right. But I'm seeing a serious separation here. And I feel like it's because of a Taurus here that wasn't being treated fairly. Was It was being done wrong. Being treated unfair. All right, so let's go into the extended. We're going to pull your person's cards, see how they feel about you, see what actions they're going to be taking moving forward towards you, and we'll also get advice for you from the universe. All right, Taurus, thank you guys so much for being here with me. I appreciate all of you and love you all so much. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button, like this video if it resonates, leave me a comment, and um, email me MissHawaiiReadings at gmail.com for personal readings. Have a blessed day. Deuces. See you in the extended.